Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be doing three more DIY fidgets you can make at home. So yeah, let's go ahead and get straight into the video. For the fifth, first fidget, we are going to be making monkey noodles. So for that, you're going to need some of these large, um, long, like balloon animal balloons. You'll also need a pump and some water. So the first thing you're going to do is blow up your balloons all the way just to loosen them up. Then you're going to let all the air out. Do that a few times. This is going to be a very long monkey noodle. You could cut it if you wanted to. But yeah, I'm going to do one that is cut and one that's not cut just to make sure. Here's the cut one, and here is the one I did not cut. I'm gonna fill them both up with water and then tie them off. So here they are. This was the long noodle, which I like this one better. And this is the little noodle. I definitely recommend using the bigger one, so just don't cut it, I guess. I don't know exactly what you're supposed to do with monkey noodles, but I think these are pretty cool, honestly. <laughs> But yeah, someone actually requested for me to do these, so that's the reason I did them. So comment down below fidgets and I'll do them. So now we're going to be making a DIY marble mesh. I know I've done one of these before, but I'm going to do a different version and I think this one's a lot better. So let me go ahead and show you. So first thing I'm going to do is get this Ziploc bag and I'm going to cut it to the size that I want it. Now what you're going to do is tape this side and this side. I would use clear tape, but I don't have clear tape right now, so I'm just going to use scotch tape. But first, before you um, tape this one, just tape this side. So this is what it looks like. Now what I'm going to do is get a marble. I got this pearl. It's a larger pearl, but you can use anything. You could even use a bead. You're going to put it in through the hole you did not seal. Then seal this hole off with tape. And now you have a DIY marble and mesh. For this next one, I'm going to be using a bottle cap. So I got this and I'm going to cut the ring off. You can use a knife or an exacto knife, maybe even scissors if you really try. Now what I'm going to do is get a balloon and I'm going to get some scar wax that I made. Um, so you can use like slime, you could use other things for this, you can maybe even use water, but I'm going to be using the scar wax. It's equal parts of water and, I mean not water, flour and Vaseline. So I'm going to be adding some of this in here, not too much, but yeah, I'm going to be adding some of the balloon. Okay, this is the difficult part. So now I'm going to put the bottle cap thing into the balloon. So this part's a little difficult but make sure that this part is facing down. So I'm gonna do this off camera. Okay, now I've got it in the balloon. So what I'm gonna do is try to feel the putty around and I'm going to try and put it in the water bottle. I know this is really difficult, but the results are pretty cool. So I'm just working it into the water bottle. Now what I'm going to do is pull the water bottle as tight as possible and tie it off. Not the water bottle, the balloon, sorry. Okay, so now I'm going to really tighten this and then cut it like right here. Okay, so I know this fidget is really weird, but I actually like it like a lot. You can push it through the putty and you have to work it through the hole, which I think is pretty fun. And then you can push it out the other side. Okay, I hope this video was enjoyable, even though it was a little weird, and I'm sorry about that. I've had some stuff going on to where I couldn't really record the best video, but I tried my best because I really needed to get this video out. Love you guys so much. I hope you enjoyed watching, and I hope you make my fidgets. Bye!